Hello, world folks. Good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of world news and analysis. Before I move on to any further details, I really love to thank you all for enormous love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for, guys? Hit that subscribe button now, and don't forget to press that bell icon. On her first appearance on Instagram in almost three years, Meghan Markle wore a necklace that appears both to honor Queen Elizabeth and her son, Archie. The Duchess of Sussex, Meghan Markle, has made her first appearance since Harry's memoir, Spare, was released in January. However, she's not making headlines for addressing the controversy, but rather for promoting a wellness coffee on Instagram. In a recent promotional video for the coffee brand Clever Blends, Meghan Markle is seen wearing an elegant emerald necklace from Logan Hallwell's Queen Collection that's worth $3,450. This piece is part of a subtle note to her royal background and her son Archie, as the emerald is his birthstone. The necklace features a Zambian emerald pendant, encrusted in a 15-diamond carat halo, and held together on a 14K delicate gold chain. The Logan Hallwell Instagram page explained that each piece of the jewelry from the Queen's collection is hand-carved individually, and each stone is unique, just like the Queen wears it. This is not the first time the Duchess has worn jewelry to pay tribute to her children. On her 40th birthday, she was featured in a video wearing Logan Hallwell's necklaces, joined together to represent the star constellations of both Archie and Lilibet, her two children. Meghan Markle wore a Taurus necklace for Archie, whose birthday is on May 6th, and a Gemini necklace for Lilibet, whose birthday is on June 4th. The necklaces were part of Logan Hallwell's Marissa collection, and are both worth around $1,785. In the same Clever Blends video, Meghan Markle is seen wearing a Ralph Lauren button-down shirt worth $235, and a Burberry silk trench coat worth $2,395, while also wearing a pair of dark skinny jeans. As well as the emerald necklace, the Duchess accessorized in an Aquasera black flats worth $360 and a Cartier tank Francaise watch, which is believed to have been gifted to Meghan Markle by Prince Harry and once belonged to Princess Diana. Hannah Mendoza, the founder of Clever Blends, is seen welcoming the Duchess in the Instagram video. Introducing lattes and praising Meghan's contribution to the company's success, she said Meghan Markle was the first investor in the company and that the Duchess was extremely passionate about female founders and sustainable sourcing. Mendoza explains that Meghan Markle had started drinking her lattes three years ago and sent them to her friends such as Oprah Winfrey, who later promoted the coffee on social media. And according to Mendoza, the company sold over six million lattes, and they owe much of that success to the power of women uplifting women. The Duchess of Sussex's recent appearance on social media has shown a subtle nod to not only Queen Elizabeth, but her son Archie, and continues to make a statement with her fashion choices, using jewelry to pay tribute to her children and supporting female entrepreneurs. It seems Meghan Markle's focus on wellness extends beyond just her personal life, as she continues to promote and invest in companies that align with her values. Despite ongoing controversy surrounding Prince Harry's memoir, the Duchess of Sussex remains focused on making positive changes in the world. It'll be interesting to see what Meghan Markle does next. But one thing's for sure, she'll continue to make headlines, whether it be for fashion choices or philanthropic endeavors. So what do you guys think about this news? Write it in the comment section below. Let me know what you think. Until then, I guess we'll just have to wait and see if things turn out to be something after all. Also, if you never want to miss any of my Sizzling World updates like this, subscribe and press that bell icon. It's as simple as that. So until next time, hasta la vista.